Hello, everybody, and welcome or welcome back to Brotato, the Arena Survival Action Roguelike itself, but modded, though. So we're going to be checking out the Elemento mod once again. Adds a bunch of characters, items, and weapons to the game. Today, we're going to be checking out the Old Witch. 15% enemy speed down, but minus 150% damage. Enemy damage up by 50%. 50% more enemies on a 33% bigger map. But we start with the Toxic Snake Tooth and plus one Poison Applied times. So we'll have to see what the hell is going on here. Uh, we got... Let's see. This is the fastest thing, but it is a melee weapon as well. Uh, so that is certainly going to be a little bit riskier than a ranged Poison Applier. This does have a little bit of piercing baked in. I'll go with the bow then, I guess. So 12. Can, we can... I guess I probably won't be able to attack fast enough to apply uh, more poison on a single enemy. But they have a 50% more damage. Okay, it's, it, we're not going to really notice right now. We'll notice more later. I feel like we're going to want... Oh my god. Alright, fine. Oh. One max HP, 8% enemy health, plus one poison applied times. Okay, can't get the bow anymore. I don't know what that means. I do know that we had this yesterday, and it's basically we have a chance to apply poison on our hits. So it's doing 12. So if this is doing 6... Okay, I'm seeing 24s, which should mean, I guess, plus one poison applied times is just when we're applying poison, we apply it twice, which checks out. But it feels like we should be doing it more often. I'll get some elemental damage. Wave three means we look for bow uh, and get upset when it seems like it never shows up. I don't know, I feel like I always remember that with the Elemento mod in general being that, like, it feels like weapons rarely show up, and it could be, it could have something to do with the fact that there are, I don't know, a million weapons and items in this mod now. So, like, finding exactly what you want is nearly impossible sometimes. That being said, getting the two guaranteed weapons in the first uh, three shops is a good call. Six health, I'll take it. Bye-bye. Crit chance, poison stack, max number up. And crit chance up. 72? 72, just like that? I mean, that's starting to get pretty good. I feel like, what, do we want attack speed, knockback? With 150% damage down... Okay, well, also worth noting, it seems like it's unlike uh, Burn, then. Because we have all of that downgrade, but we are still doing normal poison damage. So it seems like it is, it's separate from percentage damage. Good to know. I'll get some range. Attack speed seems really valuable. I think Tentacle is not going to do anything. <laughs> I think it's not going to do a single thing. Metal is probably good today. If Poison can't crit, then... Which it doesn't look like it can. Because I'm critting fairly quasi-regularly with the bow, and I've never seen a Poison crit yet. So far, so far. Attack speed seems like an amazing pickup. For the knockback of it. Ooh. And because we can actually stack our quasi burn, unlike normal burn. We need some regen sources. Really, really bad. Really, 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 really bad. Lifesteal could be okay. Not 
toxic bow. What's the upgrade? Poison damage up. And it the poison kind of like lasts longer. 96. I mean, dang. We stack it up something fierce. So if we apply two per and our max is eight. Wait, do we actually... Technically, if we're applying it three at a time, we only need to hit them with three arrows for them to be taking maximum damage per second from the poison. That's pretty gnarly. Lip head lads not shooting bullets there is weird. Because the base bow definitely does do a ranged hit. Not complaining, but it is surprising. Region sounds good. Lux sounds appealing. Ah, fine. Oh. 25% extra damage against bosses and elites sounds amazing. We have, especially because we have triple elites. This item is useless for us. We don't have any melee uh, ranged or engineering. We saw it the other day. Basically converts your non-elemental base damage stats into elemental. But I don't I don't have any, so. This is the thing. It's like it, it's a great item if you build according to it eventually showing up, but if you if it doesn't show up, then you're just buying a lot of useless stuff. Uh oh. Okay. I don't know. Could luck. Like a luck and food angle be the way to go? Could well be. Ow. Dodge and armor sounds cool. These guys hit so hard. HP regen. Armor. Piercing. I don't care about my piercing damage. I don't care even, even a little. Toxic sludge good. Experience gain up sounds good. Community, yes, community support up sounds incredible. Like, am I gonna gain armor down? Yes, but still. Like, this has pretty good knockback. Yeah, 10 knockback on a uh, double piercing weapon. Yeah, double piercing weapon. Really appealing. It is noticeably, yeah, it's different than a burn in the sense that it's like I'm finding myself having an easier time against the high, the high health enemies than anything else. Which is the exact opposite of how burn functions, usually. But we'll see. Whoop. Ooh, mama. If we had poison spread... That'd be great. Probably exists, right? Ow. One more hit and I'm dead. No, okay. <laughs> Good. Speed harvesting. I could get a little bit of lifesteal, I, I suppose. Like, 3% damage, minions. I don't have any minions. Mission Forever Elemental. Um, it's a, it's an investment. I don't know that I'm going to care about it. Glass cannon. We don't like percentage damage because we have minus 147 and this is supposed to be doing 10, but is actually doing 12. So clearly it can't be that relevant. Oh my god. This is going to be terrifying. I should have grabbed the speed up, I think. Instead of the lifesteal. I have regrets. Well, maybe the lifesteal will uh, prove valuable now. Okay. 
Okay. Scoot on through. Scoot on through. Kind of trying to spread my poison around a little bit more. Oh God, there's no money dropping over here because it's all clumped up up top. It's all clumped up right here. It's so dangerous. I got I got quite a bit right at the end there. Three elemental damage. Uh, what weapons and minions have a five percent chance to freeze an enemy for two seconds? That seems great. Another poison apply time. I think it's worth it. Crit chance. I don't care. Speed up. Yes. Health. Yes. Attack speed. Yes. Speed and life steal. Sure. Another poison apply. When poison is applied on a burning enemy, convert to apply fire poison, dealing burning damage twice, poison damage up by 20%. Minus 12 max HP. Oh, I'm going to say it's worth it, because if I get a sacred sausage, we're having a great time. Enemy speed up, range up, poison efficiency up. Oh, man. Oh, man. I don't know. Okay, I love the freeze. The chance to freeze is going to be really nice. If you can get some oops, some more attack speed or we'll get more ice cubes. I would love nothing more. Okay. Kind of wouldn't mind less enemies spawning. If we find a white flag, I might just take it or candle. Oh god. That was such a dumb I just walked into it. Oh, it's way it's wave 10, that's why. I was like, why does this feel like a freaking nightmare? Wave 10 on a run where you're not doing great feels so bad. Oh, this is so hard. I want attack speed. Elemental damage is good, but I kind of just like... Buff the friends nearby for 20% damage. I don't need 20% damage. What do I even have? What, what, what do I care about this? Snake whistle? Chance to apply... I mean, that's why I care about it. We can get the snake whistle. All right, the elite should not be too much of a problem. Okay, one would think. Okay, I'm happy to have it over horde waves, that's for sure. I'm loving the freeze. I don't know exactly what it's doing against the uh, the elite. It looks like it's maybe just slowing them down. Maybe they're... Wow. Maybe they're attack speed too. There's a lot of damage. God dang. The 50%... The 50% more damage nonsense on top of everything is so rough. So rough. More ice cube, please. Please give me one another ice cube. You know, one specific item out of the list of whatever, like, 300 items in the game now. Just give me that. No. Uh, absolutely. We don't care about percentage damage. When applying poison on a frozen enemy, convert to apply ice poison. Reduce its damage by 50%. Cancel its boosts. Cancel boost? Okay, I'm going to try it. And it's also some minus enemy speed, which sounds even better. Uh, 10... Okay, 10% 10 harvesting. 188 harvesting during the next wave. 50%... 50, <laughs> more enemies. I don't care about the, the damage down. Oh my god. I probably should have taken tractor. There was no reason not to. I'm, I'm frazzled is why. Ugly tooth is good. 50% more enemies is just gonna suck. If we had some kind of spread... Okay, so this... I, I'm ice poison. 
I see the words ice poisoned. And I like the sound of it. Okay. Ice poisoned. If we can make it through this way, we get a lot of money. Man, I, I really regret not taking tractor. Ow. Okay. Got a lot of health back from whatever ice poisoned pool, I'm thinking. I guess that's my survivability angle. Doesn't feel like there's 50% more enemies. Yeah. Huh. Damage for speed. I don't care about that. Armor, absolutely. Health, absolutely. Uh, lose your range. I could lose my range damage. Two melee, one elemental crit chance. I'll get this for like another, another ally or something. Wandering bot sounds fantastic. So speed 16, sure. Elemental, sure. And, uh, we probably should take this. I just, I feel like we need, oh my God. Extra stomach is so good. This early? You kidding me? That could be, that could be really helpful. All right, there were 50% more enemies in theory on that last wave, so one would imagine this should be easier. Okay, that snake is applying so much poison. I want more of him. More of that jabroni. Do we have snail yet? No. We do have Ugly Tooth, though? Yes. Ugly Tooth, yes. Snail, no. Uh-oh. 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 Awkward. Yo, <laughs> that was a Giga Chad maneuver. Yeah, I can't. I feel like I can't let the enemies speed up. 30 luck, it's worth it. Attack speed's great. Minion damage is probably irrelevant. I'll take metal. Healing totem. Periodically heal friends for four. I'll give it a shot. Alright. Alright. Which, which boss is it? Chef. Shouldn't be bad. He is ice poisoned. Whatever it is seems wild. Okay. Good. 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 All these summons from the enemy can die, please. Freaking hosts. Freaking hosts. I love a, um... Man. I love a monkey at this point. Pick up materials to potentially heal. That'd be such a good item. There's so many materials dropping, because we do... We have a lot more enemies. Uh, 3% damage down, enemy speed down. When poison stack is up to max limit, deal 20% of full poison damage and clear the poison. That's what it's all about. Community support? Yes. Even more. Life steal, I'll take it. Enemy speed up, poison efficiency up. I'm a little bit scared of speeding up enemies. Poison efficiency up. I don't know what efficiency up means. Is that speed? It's a little late for the crown. Luck is good. It gives us more health. Okay, yeah, we... Oh, it's so easy for us to hit our max cap that we actually... We can actually, like, kill enemies now. Okay. Oh, that's huge. Oh, that's huge. That changes everything. 
Thank God. That changes everything. We can actually, like, burst down some targets. We want anything, anything else that gives us just plus a poison applied at this point. Attack speed plus poison applied. Divine. More piercing, ricochet, like any of that stuff is going to be what we we're going to want. Okay. Beautiful. Oh, beautiful stuff. Hunting trophy. I have some crit chance, but n I'm never killing via crit, right? Uh, we're probably like over the... Okay, another snake whistle's great. We're never killing from a crit. The... the, the uh, what? 10% attack speed. Minions attack durations reduced by our attack speed as well, it sounds like. It's an extra pierce. The damage lasts longer. Oh my god. What is poison efficiency? 22. 22. It's got to be like the speed at which it ticks down, which if that's the case, that's not something I care about anymore. Oh, they're attacking so much faster. Good. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. All right. This was a very item-dependent run. Like, just night and day when we got, like, just a couple different things. Um, community support. So good. I feel like the ice poison might be helping our sustain a lot in a way that I'm not... That's not immediately very obvious. The explosion on the legendary, though. Like, that's... That's everything. That takes an item that is... Or a, a play style that is very slow. And it gives us a way to kill quickly. And also... Apply great damage over time. Like, I cannot wait to see us on the elite. Armor, yes. Healing totem, yes. Elemental damage. Bigger burns. Sure. Don't care about the magical leaf right now. Uh, harvest thing, it's... Yeah. It, it's just there's not enough waves for the magical leaf at this point. Woo boy! At this point, just getting more elemental would be really, really big. Instead of helping our damage slowly over the course of time, it actually is a big burst. Okay. Lovely. Lovely. Woo! Went from god awful terrifying to. Yeah, this is a free win at this point. Even with a 50% increased damage on the enemies, this should theoretically be pretty darn free. Beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, max health, sure. One second. All right, we got elemental over here. Damage and life steal. I could white flag. I don't. I don't think I need it anymore. I mean, I have double. Sad tomato. It just doesn't. I think I could I think I could still benefit from it. All right. Burst them down. Yeah, I think I have too much I have too much health for sad tomato to be beneficial. I also I think I was overestimating how much ice poison was doing. I thought that it was kind of like doing a lot. Maybe now that we have the burst, it actually... It may be disynergistic for the ice poison. 
But all in all, I would say, yeah, probably should not have grabbed the HP region with with this much health. But oh well. Or uh, Sad Tomato. Oh my god, the sound of the snakes. Hiss is ha, hiss is ha. Basically, just don't get bodied by a boss. Don't get hit by a boss and we're going to be totally fine. The freeze should really, really help on those, on the bosses anyways. And I'm surprised by how little damage I'm taking, considering they're supposed to be doing 50% more. Uh, I'd rather have the dodge, to be honest. Summon question mark. Sure. Let's get more HP regen now. We'll make it worth it. We'll make it worth it. Tentacle is again a no. Snail, super good. <clears throat> what the hell? He is running around doing a big explosion puff and then dying and then summoning another one shows up. What the hell? And he's applying poison. He doesn't normally apply poison. That's just because of my uh, my teeth, I guess. One would assume. Where's all the money? Where's all the money dropping that is keeping us from getting more money? Up here? Yeah, we. you can tell. Like, the fact that the money is so scattered, that means that our allies are really pulling so much weight now. And they are killing everything all over the map. Cut. Woof. Scary run turned into, honestly, a joke. I don't think my minions percent damage is particularly relevant. Silver bullet, sure. Alrighty. Alrighty. I mean, ideally, we hit both in the same shot. How? Ooh, boy. There you go. Yeah, that's how you make a damage over time run build into a build that is a boss killing build, too. Just There's a lot of really interesting items in this mod that seem to understand why Elemental is sort of weak in the base game. Does it go a little overboard with a, a couple of them? Absolutely. But I... That, <laughs> the base drop is about the... Either way. Uh, does it go a little overboard with some? Yeah. But ultimately, it makes Elemental builds quite, quite fun. Alas, alas, that's that. That's going to do it for today. If you want to check out the mod for yourself, there's a link at the top description. Thank you. Thank you. Check out my channel for Roguelikes and more every single day, and I'll see you next time. Bye.